Good afternoon, people. I hope you're all well. I'm up, at, up near Loughborough at my combines, my two little Model A Gleaners. I've got a show next weekend. I noticed that, cut on the way up here, I noticed that the, um, the barley's very close. I think there's a couple of people have been going. I mean, I think they're a little bit, a little bit eager, but there you go. I think, you know, it could do with another week or two. You can, yeah, me personally, anyway. And obviously it's all got to come in before it all falls on the floor. But yeah, just here, um, I haven't really done that much to these two this year, really. I mean, I have done a lot, but I just haven't been doing the same, obviously, with the Model C and this and this New Holland. I've obviously got a lot of other stuff going on, plus obviously <laughs> all the other stuff that ain't combines that I've got to deal with. But yeah, um, I see how today goes. I mean, it's quite late in the afternoon now. I've quite tired last weekend on the Saturday night I went out and I ended up spending all night awake you know and I had to uh, sort of force myself through the day but I've been catching up with this the lost sleep over the week first time I've done that in years you know I used to do it all the time but uh, you know it's uh, it's not a common occurrence these days uh, so yeah um, well not quite sure how to turn this camera around it is facing yeah, we'll turn it around in a minute and do another video, but yeah, um, looking good. Uh, again, like I say, I hope you're all well. I hope you're enjoying your combines and tinkering about with your, your gleaners and your tractors and balers and stuff like that. Yep, see you in a while. Hey, yeah, look at them. What a lovely pair. Aren't they nice? Not bad at all, look at them. It'd be nice, I'm looking forward to seeing them all in a row with the Model C. You know, all M3 chuggering their way up the field, brilliant, wouldn't it? Yeah, have a good one. There you go, lovely. I am um, just getting close to running that battery, and as you can see, the uh, pigeons have pooed all over my combine again. Blimmin' things. Yeah, I might have to make them into a pie. Um, yeah, so, engine started up high. Oh, it, I turned the tap off on this one, because uh, it leaks a little bit, so I turned the tap off, but I always forget, I always forget to do it. Hey, up! It's getting hot. Yeah, very hot by the look of it. Yeah. Okay, that's worth looking into, I'm sure. But I suppose it's probably just a bit of moisture in it, just evaporating. But anyway, I was saying I'm running down on on uh, battery power, so I will uh, just do what I can for the rest of the day. I haven't done that much today, to be honest, but that's okay. I'm just gonna. Have a look around the combines and see what what I can sort of like get together for next week. Make sure I don't forget anything. I'll do majority of the work on Friday. I'm going to see if I can get a local farmer or somebody to let me wash wash the residue, the like um, the oil and dirt off them, and I'll wipe them down, put the guards on, put the chains on, and everything, and uh, maybe give them a bit of a grease round and. Um, yeah, I'm going to try and get the, the wheels on tonight. Um, so, yeah, a little bit of a short video. But you get the impression. I'm going to keep, keep you posted on these old things. Uh, yeah, still very pleased with them. and like them very much. I can't choose between them. Well, I say I can't choose between them. Like I say, I think overall it's a difficult choice. But this, this nice short back one is, uh, yeah, it's a lovely combine, isn't it? I just really pleased with it, and uh, as a, as it is always the same, I I like all my combines, but this this is just a fantastic one. This is the this is like the one that I always wanted as a child. There was one of these behind the school. In fact, there was both of these behind the school, but this one, one like this short back was stripped out, and and it it took me a while to realise. I knew it was a combine, but what it looked like, and I eventually realised that it was like it was like a humpback gleaner because the humpback gleaner was complete. But yeah, I won't bore you to death, and I'll catch up with you probably next weekend, maybe Friday or Saturday, definitely. 
definitely try and post a video at the show for you. Uh, yeah, hope and pray that we're going to have some, some decent weather. So, yeah, blessings on the weather for that one. Yeah, catch up with you again. Bye.